This object is either a planet or a failed star, and it's orbiting so far away its gravity barely holds on. Discovered in 2008 in the upper Scorpius star cluster, this companion is about 14 million years old and roughly 7 to 14 times the mass of Jupiter, putting it right on the edge between a planet and a brown dwarf. It sits at an enormous separation from its host star, nearly 670 astronomical units, which means if our sun had that companion, it would be farther than the Kuiper belt by a huge margin. That separation makes its origin a real mystery. Did it form like a planet inside a disk, or like a star from a collapsing gas cloud? Its spectrum shows cool, red colors and strong signatures of low gravity, evidence it's young and still contracting. Observations also reveal methane and water absorption features typical of very cool atmospheres, giving it temperatures around 1600 to 2300 degrees Kelvin, hot enough to glow in infrared, but much cooler than stars. Because it's in a loose cluster just 450 light years away, astronomers can study its atmosphere and evolution as part of a young population, helping calibrate models of how giant planets cool and change over time. Its mass uncertainty is partly because the boundary between deuterium-burning brown dwarfs and true planets lies nearby. If it burned deuterium early on, some would call it a brown dwarf. And because it's so widely separated, its future is precarious. Interactions in a cluster could nudge it away, meaning it might become a free-floating object wandering interstellar space. Want to see more weird worlds like this? Comment which fact blew your mind and follow for more tiny, wild planets you won't believe exist.